again, welcome back. Another Abbey beer, another Leffy from my perfect draft. This is the Leffy Ritual 9. I've tried it already. It's super strong. Anyway, let's have a wee look at the colour first. Got my Leffy chalice. So, yes, it's a deep gold. Is there such a thing as a deep gold? Copper coloured, maybe deep amber. There's a wee bit of visual carbonation going on from the nucleation point. There's about half a finger of sort of a quite tight, tight pack bubbles, mousse like foam. Let's get a wee sniff. I'm getting. This, the first thing is banana. It's still a bit chilled. It comes out the... It says it's 6 Celsius. It comes out the perfect draft at 3 Celsius. Side of the glass is 5.9. Who knows? Do a wee quick colour test and all. See if that picks up anything. Let's see. Yes. Yeah, it it's beautiful, that, isn't it? It's it's like a it's like a copper colour, like a, a I don't know, deep gold. I don't know. I don't know if that's a colour. Anyway. Yeah. So it's. I'm getting a wee bit brady malt, a wee bit fruitiness and banana ness. Let's taste it. Three sips. Cheers, my dears. Yeah, I'm getting... It's 9%. You can tell it's 9%. There's not a burn, but you can tell there's an alcohol present. The... The hops, it's like... Well, it's fruity, but there's like a, a banana element there as well, so I don't know if that's from the Belgian yeast or, you know, the, the Leffe yeast that they use, I don't know what it is, but there's it's a similar vein of the Leffe beers. No, I've got maybe, I've got to be four or five. The, it's not too bitter, there is a slight bitterness, but it's beautifully balanced. You're getting caramel malt, that fruity hoppiness, that wee bit of bitterness. And it all comes together beautifully. It's not too... It's not too astringent, it's not too bitter on the tongue, you know. So, uh, carbonation... It's just the right amount for me. That's really nice. It's, it's so intense. The body's... It's not... It's not, it's not like a cloying beer or a heavy beer. It's sort of a light to medium bodied. Quite soft because of that sweetness. And it's lasting quite a while as well. It's more than 60 seconds. Not much more. But it's such, I'm going to have to call canny with this beer because it's, it is super intense, it's super strong, it's a sipper. This is not one to be rushed. It's like every mouthful is like full on, you know, so. We'll have a quick look on Untapped. Okay. It's called Leffy Ritual. Nine. It's got a nine degrees. I suppose that means the strength as well. And it's from Abbey de Leff in Flanders in Belgium. It's described here as a Belgian strong golden ale. Now I've heard it described as a blonde ale. I've even heard it described on one site as a lager. I don't think it's a lager. 
It's stop fermented. It's lager. Lager stop fermented. I can never remember. Anyway. So it's a Belgian strong golden ale. That's, that's how I would describe it. So it's 9% ABV, 25 IBU. But that is beautifully balanced in there with the sweetness. It's really nice. No French check-ins. Everyone else, 68,000. With an average of 3.64. So the style guide. It's Leffe Rituel 9. It's a top fermentation beer with a deep golden colour. The strong flavours offer this beer plenty of character. It is strong. It's. Uh, brewed according to age-old traditions, Leffe Rituel, with its deep golden colour, inspires respect. Well, I definitely respect this. I'm not going to quaff it. I'm not going to... It's elegant, distinguished flavours of grain, bitter spices and bananas will seduce your taste buds over and over again. Rich in hop and remarkably balanced with a long and intense aftertaste, aftertaste certain to thrill the more delicate part. But make no mistake, only when poured into its own chalice can this divine beer be tamed. I don't know if I've tamed it yet, but I'm going to give this... I was going to get it say 9.5, but it's super intense and it's super boozy. Yeah. I will give it a 9.5. It's, it's a world class beer. It's right up there. But it's, it's going to take a lot of drink. And I've got, I've got six litres. That's too much for one person. Well, I mean, if I have... Like a 500ml, I don't know what size this is, this is only a 330ml, up to this level here. So if I had, if I filled it up, that's 500ml I would think, so that's 12 of them. So if I had one each day, yeah, I could definitely do that. Yeah. It lasts 30 days in the perfect draft once you put it in. We'll see. I might have friends coming this Saturday. So, we'll see. It might, it might be too much for them. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time, hopefully. ta, -ta for now. Cheers, my dears. Try it if you can find it. That is full on, man. Oh! Intense.